Hi, everybody. Jeff Fox here with a little bit about the meteor that was seen all across the Middle Atlantic and New England states this evening. Uh, I'll show you where it looks like it fell in a moment, but let's uh, look and see where people have seen it. This is a heat map. It's put together from the reports of meteor sightings, and that's really helpful. Uh, individual sightings will never tell you where a meteor is because there's really no reference point. You, you don't know how high in the atmosphere it is or how large it is. Uh, people tend to estimate that they're much closer to the meteor than they really are. But with this, you can see where the most reports were seen by the hottest colors. And that would be from the area around DC up through Wilmington, Delaware, the Philly area, uh, in through Jersey, New York City, here in Connecticut, and then into Massachusetts. So that's where the most reports were received. But when you take where people were looking when they saw it and how long the delay was to hear the sound after they saw it, uh, this looks to be a pretty good depiction of where the meteor was visible. Starting off in uh, northeastern Pennsylvania, the Poconos, and then across New Jersey and out into the Atlantic Ocean. This happened about 8 o'clock Eastern Time on Friday night. Meteors themselves are not all that rare. I mean, most of us don't see too many of them in a lifetime, but over 15,000 tons of meteors fall into the atmosphere every year. Now, most of them are little tiny grains of sand and dust. This one was a little bit larger. It will probably end up being smaller than you expect, maybe something the size of a rock or a basketball. Uh, these random little bits of space junk are all around, and uh, so they hit the Earth uh, all the time. These are much more dense than comets. Comets are normally made up of, uh, of all sorts of ice, but uh, meteors tend to be stony or metallic. So uh, this had a lot of mass to it as it came in, but probably not particularly large uh, because there was not an incredibly big sonic boom and uh, not the look of a, of a really major bolide. So there you have it, a little event tonight across the East Coast. If you saw it, you were lucky. If you didn't see it, wait for TV news on Saturday. I'm sure they'll show it to you a million times. Take care.